Hey guys, Officer Lee here coming with our third video of the tutorial today. We're going to be doing a little bit of a short, shorter video. But I'm going to be taking care of the mass transit system that I want to develop here. I need to stick another cult generator. It's not going to be good. Don't want so much coal. See how much we're gonna take our electricity. All right, don't have to worry about electricity right now. But we're gonna wait our money. It'll shoot up pretty quickly. Money, once it comes up, we got all of our nice commercial lining up right here. Today we're gonna be focusing for our mass transit. I want to be doing tram lines. Which is what I like to do most. You also have the trains, subways. Personally, just stick with the buses or the trams, whichever one you might want to choose. I think I want to do a combination, possibly, depending on how much. Okay, oh, that's going to be pretty expensive, though. We got our tram line here that I'm going to do right here. All right. To do a loop right around here. Actually, I think I want to do two tram lines. I'm going to do one that comes over here to connect up to this part that comes back over here in this circle. That's probably not the healthiest thing to uh, have it line up around here, but actually, we'll do a little. Well, I have one come out here and back right around. All right. So then we have this tram line right here. Just easily hook up with the other one. This is going to be a little bit of waiting because I need to make sure that I have enough money to start doing this. But I'm going to do this somewhere. Do this right here. I'll drag this down here. It's going to cost me 910. The system I'm going to set up here is I'm going to have the tram line come down in the middle of the. Uh, this main street right here, just run up and back around. I try to keep it off streets as much as I can, but I want it going down the main part and it isn't big enough. I'm going to do like a little bit of a bus system here too, probably to sort of conjoin the two. So the more mass transit options you have, the more people you get on them, but stick to the buses and trams first, because it'll get pretty expensive. So. Once we get enough money, we're going to hook this up, and we're going to build the street back up right here to run my tram line down, and I'll hook it up around here to go in the circle to go back. Whereas here, I'll run one down along here, and connect up here to sort of connect people. I'm not sure if that will work for right now, but I'm not sure. I know this one will make money. There we go. All right. So we just need to make sure we do that, 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 that. Good. Now we're gonna have our tram line running. Mass transit, very important in the city. I I kid you not. Especially once you get to a huge population. It will take so much traffic off the roads, it's going to be unbelievable. I had my city with about 375,000 people that I've been using mods on. I had a huge mass transit system with a train, subways, buses, tram lines, you name it. it. It was just covered with all these different transit systems, okay? All over the place. And so I took all that offline just to see how much traffic it would add, and it just created a huge gridlock over the whole thing. 
I probably had like 60 tiles because I had the because I had the 81 tile map, and it was just insane. So we're gonna start off with our tram line right here, connecting up different lines too as a hub will sort of help spread. We're gonna do one right here. We're gonna try and uh, space it out so they aren't all conjoined, so it won't sort of like uh, screw up traffic. We'll also alternate them. And I'll make another one back right here. So now I'll join that back up, and now I'll connect up right there. So then your tram line is done, and they'll operate on their own. You see they're coming out here. So I'm going to go into the transit panel. You can go to your specific line, name it, also color and whatnot. Then you can go to it and also put how many ever vehicles you want on it, which will cost more money or less money depending on what you want to do. So they won't make money right away because people are going to start to have to get like an idea of what the tram line's like and everything, but eventually it'll get around there. Also, mass transit will upgrade your buildings, which gives you more money, so it's always a good thing to have. We're going to build another one. Not sure how expensive this is going to be. It's going to be about 11,000. and delete it. Then we're going to build it across the way. It's 11,000. There we go. Of course, like your turns, line it up. Do a little turn like that, and it makes everything nice and good. So that sort of also helps keep traffic trams off here, which, help will, which will help reduce the traffic. I might redo that once I get more and more traffic off. Oh, and we got a snowstorm coming in now in the middle of all this. Wonderful. Good thing I got that snow removal thing done. That's going to cost like another 5000 I guess got to wait for the money to come in. I heard thunder in the middle of the snowstorm. <laughs> Alright, so we got stops right around here. We'll make it so it stops right there. We'll add a stop right there. And I don't know. I'll add one stop right there. So it's on the way back. Got, now we got two tram lines operating, which is going to cost us some money. Yeah, I got thunder in the snow. Jeez. <laughs> Disaster detection. Don't need that. I'm going to go to our map right here. That one's already got 57 passengers. That's good. We don't need that. We'll, we'll take five. So in our budget panel here, if we go to transportation, show us how much money that's going to cost. So practically your cost for the tram line right now is just going to be running your depot. So you want to make sure your depot is sort of more like center, because that will help uh, keep stuff running good. Now I know it's getting a little backed up right here, and that's because trams are just trying to exit and everything. Oh crap, because they're trying to go in a circle and they need to go around right there. Jesus.
Yeah, that was a pretty poor design on my part. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I might have to redo this. It's so not all trying to go through and they can't get out. I just heard thunder strike something. Oh man. <laughs> Where's the snow removal? What are you doing? Get out there and fix my roads. They're covered in snow. Get that taken care of. Oh man, the whole system's just going under. Are you? No. Alright, I think we got the problem fixed. Good. Good, good, good. Mass transit set up. Although I've picked a pretty poor place to sort of have everything go around and whatnot. I'll just sort of get strained out once the traffic's all out of there. Ah, crap. Now, so another train so is going to come down here. Alright, hopefully everything gets out of here and sort of clears up. Good, good, good. Good, good. There's actually a lot of people are doing stuff. Holy crap. There's a lot of people here. He's on tram line one. Ninety people on tram line two. Oh man. Wow. Tram lines will also earn you money. So that's always a good thing having them set up. Comes right over here. Okay, that's why it's looking in the wrong place. Right now, it's making about 200, so it's not making back its money yet, but it'll get there eventually. While we're at it, I'm gonna add a bus depot. We'll do a bus system. I'll add it right there. The bus systems only cost the bus depot and they can run on the regular roads. Or you can also add in bus lane roads all over the place too. So, let's space them out. We got our one bus line down. So we're gonna sort of, let's see, do right there, there, there. So making our way back up. No, we don't want to do one right there. I'll do one right there so we don't have to go back up. Do all that. Nope. Wanted to make sure you try and cover the whole area. But. Not overlap as much as possible. 
So, we got our bus system set up too. Which I've also got some DLC buses because I don't like the ones they got in there and they look real nice. See, I got a Solaris Urbino. What's that one? A Gillian Lothlor. That one looks really nice. I know this is a Nova. Let's see, that one's a regular one. I don't like it. DLC stuff, a lot better. Oh, that's the new flyer. New Flyer and Nova are probably my favorite type of buses. Also, these systems will help keep people off the road, so that's a nice way of doing that too. So, got all that fixed and whatnot, we're actually making a crap ton of money. So when we pay back... Oh no, that was already repaid back. Good. Economy wise, everything else is good. And also, do taxi, which will help make you money. Let's see, this road's getting real busy. Holy mackerel. I really like keeping the tram lines separate though, because that helps get rid of the traffic, but I sort of need that right there for them to connect up to. Though I could put it off the street, which might help. Yeah, you got a snowplow here. Alright, I think the roads are looking good now. So we got our mass transit all set up and everything. We'll just go into the budget and see what's going on with our money. Transit right now is costing us about 14000 15 We're making about 200 <laughs> It'll get better though, and I'll probably end up redoing the bus lines to sort of make it better once it starts expanding. Okay, everything's looking good, good, good. So I'm just going to check on our power. Good right there. Water, we're good. Everything's good. We want to add in some unique buildings. Want to do any of that? I don't know. So it's pretty expensive. Education wise. Education, we're good. Oh, what about parks? We do parks. That's where we got all that stuff. We got Snowman Park, Ice Sculpture Park, a Sledding Hill, a Curling Park, Skating Rink, Ski Lodge, a little fire pit. That's really cool. I think I'll do a little, uh, sledding hill. Even all that out. Now I'll grow back even. That's good. Nice little sledding hill. I'll also upgrade buildings, too. I got a good amount of money, right? Oh. Great, I can pay back that loan. Get even more money. Alright, so we're making a large sum of money. So there's a lot we'll be able to expand and mess around with once we get back to our next episode. So you can see we properly set up our mass transit system now. It's uh, doing a very good job. Got 36 people on that tram. It's good. Now, obviously, since this is your only expense with the mass transit, the more lines you got coming out of that one uh, depot, 
uh, the better. So always just sort of remember that and put that in mind. So thank you guys for watching this tutorial series. Uh, if you want more of this series, please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't know to which extent I'll do this to, but we still got a lot of stuff to go through and everything with operating the city. So I'll keep going along with it. We still got like airports, we got the railroads, the seas and whatnot, different industrial areas, more education and other stuff. So we'll take a look at all that other stuff later. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.